Greetings, welcome to Facts About Everything. I'm your host, James Egan. Today on Space Week, we'll be looking at Uranus. That's the first time I ever did that in one take. That's Uranus? Doesn't look like anything. Looks like, looks like a snooker ball. Uranus is named after the Greek god of the sky. His Roman name was Celis. On average, Uranus is 1.79 billion miles from the sun. At its closest, Uranus is 1.71 billion miles from the sun. At its furthest, it is 1.86 billion miles from the sun. From Earth, Uranus is at its closest 1.6 billion miles. Uranus's average temperature is minus 224 degrees Celsius. So if you go, please wear a coat. Despite the fact that Uranus's surface is quite nippy, its core is 4,737 degrees Celsius. Uranus takes 84 years to travel around the sun. It takes two hours, 39 minutes, and six seconds for the sun's light to reach Uranus. Uranus's name has been the butt of many jokes, is that no pun intended or pun intended? I don't know. Weirdly, because of the heavy level of methane in Uranus's atmosphere, the planet smells awful. It actually smells like rotting eggs. Uranus's diameter is 31,763 miles. Although you can't tell from a normal picture, Uranus is sideways. No one knows why. The most obvious theory is it got hit by another planet, which would have knocked it off its center. That sounds like it makes sense, except Uranus isn't solid so an impact would have no effect. Unfortunately, there is no other logical theory. Uranus has a ring like Saturn. The ring isn't horizontal like Saturn's, but vertical because the planet rotates vertically. The rings were discovered in 1977. Uranus has 13 rings. They are mostly made of ice. They were probably created when one of Uranus's old moons was destroyed by a comet or asteroid. The spacecraft Voyager 2 passed Uranus in 1986. One day in Uranus lasts for 17 hours and 14 minutes. Okay, this next one, I promise is true. Uranus's original name was George. Uranus is classified as an ice giant. Uranus moves six miles per second. Okay, this is probably the coolest thing about Uranus. It rains diamonds. Between August the 6th, 2014 and August the 6th, 2015, storms appeared on Uranus that were so powerful they were visible through telescopes on Earth. This is what Uranus sounds like. Uranus has 27 moons. They are named after characters from William Shakespeare and Alexander Pope. The moons are called Cordelia, Ophelia, Bianca, Cressida, Desdemona, Juliet, Portia, Rosalind, Cupid, Belinda, Perdita, Puck, Mab, Miranda, Ariel, Umbriel, Titania, Oberon, Francisco, Caliban, Stefano, Trinculo, Sycorax, Margaret, Prospero, Setebos, and Ferdinand. I can't believe I did that in one take. My frame rate's really sporadic. It might just switch off for 10 seconds and I have to redo it. So, so, winning. The moon Miranda has the tallest cliff in the solar system. It's about five miles high. It would take a human six minutes to fall off and hit the bottom. Miranda is known as the ugly duckling of the moons. Miranda looks like a bunch of rocks were stuck together with superglue. This is what Miranda sounds like. And finally, the most interesting fact about Uranus is, although it is the second farthest planet from the sun, it was the first one to be discovered. That is impossible. At some point in your life, you have seen Mars or Venus or Jupiter. Those planets were visible for millennia. And if you've been watching these videos in order, you'll know that they were seen by the Assyrians and the Babylonians. But here's the thing. Any time those other planets were seen, they were regarded as unusual stars, not planets. Humanity knew that there were stars, but they had no idea that there was other planets in the universe. Uranus was discovered accidentally by William Herschel in 1781 while he was studying stars. He noticed that Uranus moved like a planet and it was too small to be a star. Personal thank you to these fine people for all of their help. Thanks for watching. See you again.